this little guy. This is Quigley. Quigley's a uh, three-year-old male koala. Um, I'm sure everybody knows we only have one species of a koala in the world, and it's only here you can see my arm falling grease. Oh, there we go. That's better, isn't it, mate? So um, we only have one species of koala in the whole entire world, and it's only found here in Australia. Um, but what you'll find is um, we need to separate them now. Being the fact that we are quite a quite a tall continent from so top to bottom, we're quite a long continent. We have a quite a range of climates now. If you can imagine, they are the same species, but we do need to separate them. We have northern koalas, so quickly up here in Pansy is a northern koala. Anywhere further down south from Brisbane, we refer to them as southern koalas now. And what you'll find is um, they are the same species, they just range a fair bit in shape, size and coloration. Now, if you can imagine up here in Cairns or up here in the north, it's very, very hot. So you want to be as small as you possibly can. You don't want any big bulky limbs and you don't want lots of big fat muscle deposits making you hotter during the daytime. So these guys remain very, very small and quite slender as far as koalas go in Australia. Now, um, the, to give you a bit of an idea, quickly he's about 6.1 kilos, 6.2 kilos. So he's um, a good average koala. Um, but the biggest koala we've bred up here in the north is 9.2 kilos. So not a lot, not a lot bigger than, than quickly here. Probably get something around about that size. Even 9.2 kilos, which is a very large northern koala, is quite small in comparison when we start talking about koalas um, further down south around New South Wales and um, Victoria. Now, whereabouts are you guys from you, Victoria? He would look quite small as far as the koalas do. Um, something else we notice is the, the coloration of them. Um, again, being very hot and a lot of UV light up here, these guys remain very, very grey in coloration. Um, once you, especially in Victoria, once you get around sort of Phillip Island and that, they're very, very chocolatey brown and things like that. Um, because of the opposite, very cold like what the hell is nice and dark, and absorb as much heat as you possibly can. Um, massive, massive size difference. Um, as I mentioned, around that 9 kilos is a very, very large koala up here in the north. 